Welcome to Sketch Buddies. Where we learn to draw together. together. This is my sketch buddy Lance, and I'm Professor Sketchemall. Come along and join, join the, the fun! fun! Welcome back, Sketch Buddies. Today we're drawing an ellipse. All right. So an ellipse is basically an oval. So let's pretend that this uh, tape that we see here is a tire, okay? Or a wheel from a car. So what happens is when we're looking at it straight on, it's going to be a circle. But when we start to change the angle, or like let's say the tire is turning, now what do we see? It's an oval, right? This shape here is an oval and it's called an ellipse. Okay? So that's the shape that we're going to try. It's a really important shape because once we start turning our objects in, in 3D, then we're going to have to draw it from different angles. All right. So it's going to be like an oval. And what's special about an ellipse is that if you cut it in half, this shape over here flipped to the other side is going to be the exact same shape. So for ellipses, it's a little bit hard to draw them straight on like this. So what I like to do is I like to turn my paper a little bit and then do them like that. I also like to do my lines that way too because I'm drawing this way. So I also practice my lines going away. It's just more natural for me. Whatever works for you guys, you can do that. Okay, so I have my ellipse here now. Um, so let's just make a shape out of it. I'm just going to do a can, okay? And then this same ellipse, I'm going to put it down here. I'm going to dot it. because if this is a can, you don't see the other side. So I'm just going to darken this bottom line here and just the lines that you see. Okay, and maybe I'll do another ellipse right here or just that line. So then let's fill it with paint. Okay, let's just say paint and then we can we can do a handle that's just an upside down U shape all right maybe for this one I'm gonna turn that into a wheel all right so I'm just gonna draw the line down shorter and then I'm going to copy that same line over here, down over here. And then I'll do a little ellipse inside here. And then we can shade this in. And that's our tire. Cool, good job Lance. And uh, let's draw something out of this ellipse, or we'll call it a cylinder now. Okay, so I'm going to do a, a triple layered cake, okay? So I'll do one ellipse. I'm going to draw the lines down from the sides. I'm going to copy this curve here to the bottom. Then I'm going to draw another ellipse here. I'm going to dot it this time because the back is not going to show up, right? And then we're going to draw <laughs> lines down here. Oh, it looks like uh, little Alex has joined us. I'm going to copy this line here down here again. 
And then I'm going to do one more ellipse. And I'm going to draw this line down here for the last layer of cake. Cool. Yeah, keep bringing it down, I Lance, there you go. Okay, and then we can put our candles on it, or we can put decorations on it. Anybody watching this channel, if it's your birthday today, Sketch Buddies wishes you a happy birthday. Let's put a lot of candles. Like 102 years old? Like 102. Put, put some wavy designs on our cake. I'll, I'll get some wavies on it. The wavies might be. This is this is sweet color. Yes. Why don't you put that on for the candles? No, make a candles. Ra Make a rainbow. Well, we need those for the candles, the tips. Can you draw that? No, I have to do this. Thank you. Sorry, guys. Alex is joining us. It's okay. He's learning how to draw too. Alright Lance, you want to put some fire on those candles? Then let's make a rainbow. How about in this? We might do green. Aha, green. Alright guys and gals, thank you for joining us today on Sketch Buddies. We will see you next time.